Thessalonikim, Rishon, 1 Thessalonians 4. Furthermore, then we beseech you, brethren, and exhort you by Adonai Yahusha, that as ye have received of us how ye ought to walk and to please Yahuwah, so ye would abound more and more. For ye know what commandments ye gave, rather, we gave you by Adonai Yahusha. For this is the will of Yahuwah, even your sanctification, that ye should abstain from fornication, that every one of you should know how to possess his vessel in sanctification and honor, not in the passionate lust, even as the other nations which know not Yahuwah, that no man may go beyond and defraud his brother in any matter, because that Yahuwah is the avenger of all such, as we also have forewarned you and testified. For Yah has not called us unto uncleanness, but unto holiness. He therefore that despises, despises not man, but Yahuwah, who has also given unto us his Ruach HaKadosh. But as touching brotherly love, ye need not that I write unto you. For ye yourselves are taught of Yahuwah to love one another. And indeed ye do it toward all the brethren which are in all Macedonia. But we beseech you, brethren, that ye increase more and more, and that ye study to be quiet, and to do your own business, and to work with your own hands, as we commanded you, that ye may walk honestly toward them that are without, and that ye may have lack of nothing. But I would not have you to be ignorant, brethren, concerning them which are asleep, that ye sorrow not, even as others which have no hope. For if we believe that Yahusha died and rose again, even so them also which sleep in Yahusha will Yahuwah bring with him. For this we say unto you by the word of Yahuwah, that we which are alive and remain unto the coming of Yahuwah shall not prevent them which are asleep. For Yah himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the shofar of Yahuwah, and the dead in Mashiach shall rise first. Then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet Yah in the air, and so shall we ever be with Yahuwah. Wherefore, comfort one another with these words.